How's it going, you guys? As always, my name is Kevin, and welcome back to another Call of Duty video. So, in this video, um, essentially, I'm just gonna be spectating for a little bit, and I guess talking about the future for our channel and the future for everything, really, to be honest with you, what it's gonna be happening with Vanguard releasing in just less than four days. So, honestly, the main thing right now is I've been lacking on YouTube content, and well, it's been a pretty still um, thing so far with the whole, the whole gaming industry and just games in general. Just everything's been pretty still lately. But, you know, we're back. You know, I'm back anyways, making content. And this video is just more of a spectating kind of like um, spectating slash update video on what's going to be happening with the channel. So with my channel, obviously Cold War, um, you know, we did Dark Matter, Ultra. Which is something I'm going to be doing again in Vanguard um, on Thursday night, I think, or Friday morning, whatever it is. We'll be doing that all over again. Whole Dark Matter or Master Camo um, grind or whatever. And another thing, too, with Cold War was I did a lot of clip, like clips, you know, for montage and stuff. And that, again, is going to come back, you know, with the channel um, again on uh, Vanguard this Thursday. Another thing that's happening, too, that's going to be a bit different is... We're going to focus a little bit more on Warzone itself and metas. Something I've been really wanting to do since I think probably season three of Cold War was doing um, loadout videos for the game for um, Warzone. It's just my PC wasn't able to really successfully run Warzone properly the way I would like it to. And now that I have a new CPU and a new graphics card, I could really do that now. So with Vanguard coming out on Thursday, I really want to take a leap into that type of content creating where I play with all the guns, find out the best attachments for them, and basically show you guys what's good, what's not good on that game, and so on and so forth, you know? I also want to do that on Vanguard as well, doing loadouts, doing best sniper setups, setting setups, etc. I did a little bit on that on the beta, and honestly, I loved it. I absolutely did. But yeah, just a little bit, a little bit of an update of what I want to do with my channel and with my content, because... Cold War was the first year of content creating for me. This is... I'm literally going to be hitting my second year of content creating. Or my one year anniversary, I mean, sorry. My one year anniversary of content creating. And, you know, I want to bring more to the table this time around for this year. So, that being said, welcome to a brand new video. Today we're expecting Warzone. And we're just, you know, talking about Vanguard, I guess. So, today we're... Um, we're expecting Ronald. <laughs> Ronald underscore 7545. He is level 48, and he is camping under the main building of downtown. So, yeah. Something um, I've been wanting to talk about as well was my lack of content, and I am sorry. It's just games have been very stale, and I've been kind of lazy, to be fair. Um, we'll be continuing our Far Cry Let's Play for sure. It's just I need to get to editing those videos. I haven't edited videos in a cool minute. But yeah, be sure to check out You know the content going to be coming out in the next few days, you know. I have a lot of ideas coming along, like I said, uh, Master Camo Challenge, um, loadout videos, you know, Warzone videos as well. It's going to be crazy, you know. I'm going to be back on the grind and getting everything ready. And, dude, I'm psyched, man. I'm psyched for War I'm psyched for Warzone. Um, this new map, I'm psyched for Vanguard especially. Hit clips all over again. There's a player right under him. Let's see what he's going to do. I think he's going to camp out the loadout and see if he can kill him when he comes back up. Because he is going up the stairs right now. Let's see what he does. Got it? He dipped. Dude, what are you doing? Just go kill him. Oh, got him right there, too. Nice, man. All right, so Ronald killed our boy Azjar19. I, I don't know how to pronounce it. This guy is definitely a noob, though. I feel like he really is. He, um... He, oh, no, he just plays like he doesn't know what he's doing. And, I don't know, it looks weird. It's weird, for sure, but... You know, our boy Ronald's using the whole um, heartbeat sensor, and he's using the C4 as well with the MP5. He takes back the ground loot MP5 and drops the loadout MP5. He picks up the, the guy's EM2, though, I believe, and he's just going to be running with that. All right. Dude, you literally have enough for a UAV. Go buy one so you don't have to use your stupid radar. I hate the thing that... The, the, no, dude, it annoys me. I'm sorry. But it annoys me when people rely on their radar so damn much. Like, dude... Why do you have it out? <laughs> like, jeez, bro. He's just camping the loadout, bro. It's so annoying. It's crazy. Oh, 
Finally! Finally, dude. Thank God someone killed him. I'm sorry, but like, Jesus, bro. How did he not hear someone behind him? Like, I even heard the guy behind him straight up. Alright, so now we're playing um, K Crater 816. So, my boy already has two kills on the, on the dime right here. Let's see what he does. He has an MP5 as his primary gun or secondary gun. Not sure. He has an MP5. And he's, again, using another radar, which is totally fine. You know? This guy's moving around, though, which is different for sure. He has a radar and he has a thermal for his lethal. Just picked up another thermal. Let's see what he does. And look at that. Look at that, dude. Look at that. He just waits for him. He, he taunts him like he did something, bro. That's what pisses me off probably the most, dude. Is the guy taunts him like he did something, but he didn't do anything. Alright, so he hears footsteps. Alright, so he hears someone just open the door. He has a riot shield. Riot shield against person that's camping. He gets stunned. Riot shield pushes him. Hits him with the Cali sticks, and he is down for the count. Zombie Rad has killed Crater. Oh, boy. Now we're expecting a guy with the riot shield and Cali sticks. Let's get right into this. Or not. Anyways, this guy's running OTS-9, and he has six kills on the board. This guy knows what he's doing. I think he just saw someone cross, but, yep, he did. Perfect, perfect. The right shield guy is there again. I think that was him. Not exactly sure. Someone throws a stun at him, but he doesn't hit him. He gets sniped to his right, but still, he does not know where exactly he's getting shot from. He moves like Joe Woe over here, trying to dodge all the bullets that are coming onto him. Moving and moving. He armors back up. All right, he's crossing towards the train tracks. He gets shot. Amari is down for the count. He is trying. Don't know. He has a self res. He gets shot again. He's back up once again. All right, Amari now going up the mountain. Armors up one more time. He sees the cyber glint, but yet he still does not do anything. He runs back into the higher ground, pulling back all the way. Fully armored up now. He pulls out his car 98. All right, Amari now hiding in the bush using his uh his radar, his heartbeat sensor to spoke out anybody that's around him possibly. Pulls out his car, he hears footsteps towards his right. Turns around, makes sure he has a chance to defend himself. He sees the target, he shoots, he misses. He looks away, looks back at him at the right shield, menace right in front of him. He looks to his right, still watching the right shield guy. Right shield guy misses his stun. The right shield guy hits him with a thermal, just barely. And Amari gets shot from the back by, um, Cool. Now we're spectating. As we see, right shield guy taking shots. Right shield guy begins to push out of frame. Now we're spectating Cool Deluxe, or whatever you want to call it. Cool gets shot and killed. Right shield guy, zombie guy, zombie rad guy is now the killer. I, I have no idea what I'm saying here. I am trying. This is very intense. So now we're spectating Zombie Rad. He's using a ride shield. He sees a sniper scope right in front of him. But he just... He moves to the left. He doesn't give two shits about him. Alright, he's running ride shield. I think knives, I think. Or Cali sticks. Not exactly sure. But he does see his target right in front of him. He makes sure to point the ride shield right in front of him. Just so he doesn't get shot. He's moving. He throws a stun. Misses. He sees his target, throws a, th throws, a, throws a thermal, hits him pretty well. The enemy's in, oh my god, this guy is set for life. This guy is two, level 212, this guy has four kills on the board. He knows exactly what he's doing, he's getting shot from the back, turns around quickly, throws a thermal, hits him with a thermal, gets shots from the back, he is down, getting shot from both sides, the back and the front, and he is dead. Alright, guy in the front kills um, the sniper guy, I don't know what to call him. He kills both, though. All right, so now we're expecting TTV KY Slays. He's level 136. He's rocking a Car 98 with an ACOG. He has a uh, crossbow on deck. He's rocking a thermal ACOG, and he's rocking an OTS-9. Let's see what he does here. He uh, scopes out the area to see if there's anybody around down there. But, oh, he takes shots from the up the mountain. He pulls out his sniper, sees him on his scope. He misses his shot. Sees him again, misses again. Shoots and misses. Shoots and misses again through the bush. Shoots and misses again. He's now reloading his gun now. 
Oh, he hits him. Hits him again. Misses again. I think this is a Swiss, not a Carnegie. I might be wrong about that, so I apologize. He throws his bow and arrow, hoping to kill him. The guy reses himself and moves to the right. He misses again with his bow and arrow. He's rotating left, trying to see if he can get up on the mountain. There's only two people on game right now. These two are the last fighting warriors of this battle royale. Who will win it? The guy all the way... Oh, and he is down for the count. KY Slays has slayed the lobby and won the game. Battle Royale victory. Well, that's it for the video, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Appreciate all your guys' love and support. Um, I'll try to do another video like this. I really like doing these videos, these spectating videos. I need to get better at them. I think... I think it's great, you know, to just lay back and chill and just watch someone else play the game just to see how they played it in, um, in solos. I think it's absolutely fun. But thank you guys so much for watching. Appreciate all your guys' love and support. I'll be um, hopefully making another video probably tomorrow or probably throughout the, throughout the week or so. Obviously, be ready for tons of content for Vanguard. Like I said, I'm doing Mastery Camo. I'm doing loadouts, um, loadout setups for Warzone and Vanguard's multiplayer. I'm also doing zombie content as well, giving it a try. And also, be sure to check out my Let's Play on the campaign on Vanguard. And yes, we'll be continuing our Vanguard, our Vanguard, our, our uh, Far Cry Let's Play as well. It's just I need to edit those videos and put them out. But yeah, thank you guys so much for your love and support. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out.